April Rose here with Mike Huff for 89 seconds on 890 powered by Xfinity. Now, I have a series of questions for you. You have 89 seconds to answer them. It's a little bit of a challenge. Are you ready? I am definitely ready. Have you ever done something like this? No. All your live TV, your entire DVR, every on-demand title on any device in home. TV on every screen is awesome. The all new Xfinity Stream app included with Xfinity TV. Xfinity, the future of awesome. Timer on the clock, here we go. What does it mean to be a Sox player? It means to play in your hometown. I am from Wilmette. Donnie Paul, my teammate, was from Evergreen ah, Park. Ah, okay, cool, very cool. I'm from the North Suburbs too. There you go. What high school did you go to? Nutra East, okay. back when there were two, so I'm kind of old. Okay, I'm Glenbrook North. Oh, I'm so sorry. A little bit of rivalry, maybe. Not a bit of rivalry right there. <laughs> right, right, right. Well, who would win in a fight? You versus Ron Kittle. Oh, Ron Kittle, for sure. Why is that? Oh, because he's uglier and bigger, <laughs> and so, yeah. If you could change one thing about baseball, what would it be? I would get all the catcher's gear off the hitters. I think the hitters need to get in there, and if the pitcher hits you or throws at you, guess what? Get out of the way! Favorite sitcom growing up? Favorite sitcom growing up? Oh, that's a good one. Uh, wasn't really a sitcom guy, but I'd probably say Dick Van Dyke. Really? I'm old. Yeah, I'm old. Hey, I never saw that one. <laughs> Does he have any one-liners you remember? Uh, no, but I used to love how he would fall over the ottoman as he would walk in, and I would love the show um, that he was the writer of. Yeah. So. Best baseball movie? Oh, best baseball movie is, that's a tough one. It's either The Sandlot or Bull Durham. Okay, All you, most of the guys are saying Sandlot, so. Yeah, Sandlot's a classic. I mean, the, the scene in the pool, the scene with the dog chasing the guys, yeah. I mean, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's a classic. If you were president for the day, what would you do? If I was president for the day, I would, oh my gosh, how cool is that? I would, wow, that's a good one. I would probably go to Congress and tell everybody to grow up and start working together for the good of the country and stop with the politics the way it's been going. Perfect way to end 89 seconds. Thank you for your time. Thank you very much, April.